This is my unboxing for the October 2015 Nerd Block Classic. And this box is $19.99 a month plus shipping. And it does ship to other countries. I'll put the details down below. There are also some coupons for this box. And um, I paid for this box myself. Honestly, I don't know what account it comes from because apparently I signed up and I need to find out what email address I used because I was surprised to see it again. So I have to track that down. All right, so there's a information card and it tells you everything in the box with a little description. And the spoilers um, indicated there was going to be uh, two vinyl figures in this month's box. So this is the vinyl figures. It is from Alien, and, and this is Ripley and um, Big Chap. And oddly enough, I was really surprised to see this. I already took a peek in the box because Horror Block for September had the same twin pack only with uh, Parker and a different Big Chap. So it, it just it seems odd that they did a different block the next month with the same kind of vinyl figures. And I know all of the Nerd Block, I believe all of the Nerd Block boxes, you know, classic, arcade, and the like, are supposed to have two vinyl figures in it. Um, you can check my spoilers page for each individual block to confirm that, but I know there's several that have two vinyl figures, so I don't know what horror block's going to have this month, if it's going to have this one. Um, it just, it seems a little odd. It's very close to what September was, so I would have thought this would have been in September's, but it's not. So here's the t-shirt, and this was also released as one of the spoilers. Oh, cool. It's my, I forgot what size. Yeah. So I uh, forgot that I sized Nerd Block Classic for me. So this is for me. This is um, Peltzer's Pets and has a mogwai on it. Do not feed after midnight. And when you turn off the lights, it glows in the dark and it turns into this little picture here of a gremlin. And it says feed after midnight. So really cool shirt. I love it. Love all the Gremlin movies. From The Simpsons, this is a Moe's Tavern coaster. And it has some kind of like a plastic cover, has the cork bottom. It says, put your mug on my mug. Moe's Tavern. This is really neat. My husband loves The Simpsons, so this will go to him. There's a spoiler that there was gonna be a gem in the holograms item. And it is gem. And the holograms outrageous annual and it doesn't say the price it's so neat let's open it up all right so this has an exclusive cover and then here is a look inside really neat this one will definitely be for me then we have some bob's burgers mad libs and this is just a fun mad libs are always fun these are nice to do like in the car to fight boredom and stuff Fun addition. We have a Zombie Hunter official issue dog tags. So here's what they look like. This one says zero zombie emergency response um, operations. And then this one, it is hard to see, um, says Zombie Hunter, shoot them in the head and they'll stay dead. This will go to my husband. I feel like. Then we have um, an information card about Sci-Fi Block. This is a new block from Nerd Block. And the first block includes um, a Star Wars The Force Awakens Funko Pop, a celebrity autograph, and more. And there are some of the brands that are going to be appearing in the box. I'm really interested. I might end up subscribing because I'm really wanting to see what's in there. Okay, so here are spoilers for the November Nerd Block Classic. There will be an exclusive item from Firefly along with great items from Star Wars The Force Awakens and a Sherlock exclusive. Interesting. All right, so that is everything in the box. Um, I thought it was nice. It didn't blow me away. I'm really kind of a little disappointed about the Funko. Uh, like I said, it's just so similar to the September final figures. I just think it should have been in the September nerd block as opposed to October. But, you know, I do like Ripley, so I'd rather actually have this final set than the Horror Block set. And if you missed my Horror Block unboxing, this is last month's Horror Block uh, two-pack. So, I'll be interested to see what the Horror Block um, 
has this month because I know it has two vinyl figures as well. So I'm not sure if it's going to be this one or not. Thanks so much for watching. If you want to subscribe, the link and coupon codes are down below. I'll have a full written review. Thanks for watching and have a great day.